Hello, this is Mr. Inadequate. I have already done this video, but I deleted it because it was pointed out to me there was no audio. And when I in, went into OBS, which is what I use, I discovered that OBS kindly reset everything to basically took off all my settings. So hopefully this will be a, a video that you can hear me. The game is Knights of Honor 2 Sovereign. And this is mostly a little bit of a look at it. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. So anyhow, let's look at it. As you just saw, I can change starting period from 1110 AD 1224 AD or 1360 AD. Difficulty, easy, normal, hard, very hard. I have it set on easy because this does not, I played a little bit of it since I tried to do the first video and it's different for me at any rate. So I wanted, I'm going to have it on easy for a while. You can pick a kingdom, a province, a random kingdom or a random province. Kingdom size historical, which is where I would leave it. It's basically historical or one, two, three, four, five provinces. Religious standing challenging, I would do it historical. Starting gold normal. I cheat very high. Leave kings aging uh, normal and espionage. Roll on, roll on full. Now, we're going to choose the Kingdom of Navarra. We'll see what we get. It's not going to be a long video. This is just a look at. I'll leave you to uh, read the tutorial. I'm not going to read it. A little tired today. Just pause and read if you need to. Now, Royal Court. Okay. Kingdom Resources, which is Treasury, books, religion, commerce, food income, and kingdom levies. Opinions. Right there, I guess. I don't know. Somebody doesn't like me. It's probably because I don't think my king has an heir. Crown authority. What's... Okay, we'll get there. Royal family. War and packs. Province overview. Great powers and rankings. Advantages. Settings and time manipulation. Okay. Now, let's pause this. And we're going to go into here. His Excellency, the King, and his most noble family. Now, <clears throat> when I started this the first time, it was a different king, had no queen, and there's no children. So, royal family, king, queen, children, and important relatives. Having a healthy royal family, I am pretty sure, increases stability. That's my king. That's his abilities. He's not as good as the other one who was more balanced. The queen. Her abilities are added to those of your king. There's the children, which we don't have any. And uh, 
you can you can wed prince and princesses to a noble from another kingdom that's where you would assign an heir important relatives traditions now traditions I don't have any because I have to have a knight that has learned that skill at maximum level. So that could take a little tinkering, 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 whichever. Okay, the merchants don't like us. Nobody else, well, and the uh, peasants don't like us. Now, if we go up here, we can hire somebody to the noble court. We can hire a marshal, a merchant, a diplomat, a cleric, or a spy. We're going to hire a diplomat. We need more allies. Now, it just pretty much said that, or I did. Now, his level is determined by what skill he possesses and how skilly is it each one let's get through the tutorial that's his status now what we're going to do One of several randomly chosen skills can be learned in a knight, by a knight. A knight may learn up to three skills that are primary to his class and two secondary skills. Now, what we want to do here, courtesy, bargain, siegecraft. Courtesy. We're gonna lovely readings. Perhaps at a later time. Okay. And I'm pretty sure it'll say this. Now too. is not the time. Okay. So we're who needs convincing? Okay. I'm pause for a At your service, sire. Yeah. I want to improve relations with Barcelona. Wait a minute. Where is Barcelona? This is Barcelona, isn't it? Maybe we can't improve relationships with them. How about Zaragoza? Possibly Barcelona is part of us. See, these are things that uh, I really need to learn before I can do a playthrough on this. How about let's go all the way down here? Let me go over here. This is me exploring the game. Oh.
skip this for a minute. That's part of Aragon. Okay. That's one way to find out what I wanted to know. You need advice? I want to improve relations with Aragon. I'm on my way. Okay. <laughs> it is going to take me a while to uh, figure out what I'm doing in this game. Eventually, bits and pieces of gameplay will come through. And, uh... We will see what happens. Until then, I hope you enjoy this video, this look at it, and I hope that uh, I'll be able to play some of this for you guys, if you wish. Let me know in the comments. Now, tomorrow, there will be an extra video, just like today's is an extra video, and that video will be on the game Ixian, which I will be picking up. I have a feeling I'll more likely be able to do a playthrough on Ixion than on this game. This game's going to take some learning. I admit to my inabilities. I am Mr. Inadequate after all. So, I hope you enjoyed the book. I hope my voice is coming through, and I will see you next time.